Each hour, pop and step. Push your friend when things get rough. Each hour, pop and step. Can't do a little cause you can't do enough. Sid and Marty Croft are brothers who made the awesomest, cheesiest, funnest children's television shows around the late 60s through the 1970s and a little bit of the 80s. And their kids' shows were campy, surreal, trippy, and psychedelic. Because it was the times. By the way, Sid is on Instagram and does live Q&As every Sunday. So if you like his shows, follow him and hear firsthand accounts of this era. No, I did not like the Bugaloos. They were actually the 1970s version of the Teletubbies. But I did like Martha Ray as Benita Bazaar. She was great in this role. In fact, even as a kid, I was rooting for her as the villain instead of the Bugaloos. Let's watch the Banana Splits instead. They were Hanna-Barbera, but Sid and Marty Croft designed the costume so this was their first break into Hollywood. One banana, two banana, three banana, four. Four bananas make a bunch and so do many more. Over hill and highway the banana buggies go. Coming up to bring you the banana split show. Making up a mess. Wait, was that Drooper breaking the stripper pole? Okay. Marshall Will and Holly on a routine expedition met the greatest earthquake ever known. <laughs> okay, sorry that I had to subject you to that, but that's not even half as bad or good as the real Land of the Lost, which was super fun. Here it is. Marshall, Will, and Holly on a routine expedition met the greatest earthquake ever known. High on the rapids, they struck their tiny raft and plunged them down a thousand It's a tyrannosaur. Come on, let's get going before he sees us. Come on. Oh, that was close. Again. I wonder why he's so grumpy. It's not that he's so grumpy, but he's got to eat to survive. Yeah, he doesn't care what or, or who he eats. I want to go home. We all do, honey. We don't even know where we are. I don't know how we got here or why, but I think we're in another world. What makes you say that, Dad? Gee, son, I think it might be because I saw dinosaurs. Did you ever notice that we don't normally see dinosaurs every day? So the fact that we see dinosaurs and they're chasing us might indicate that we're in another dimension. Let's go see. Holly. Oh, come on. Holly, we're supposed to... Oh. The bad acting is half the fun of this show. And besides, Will is hot. He doesn't have to be able to act. It's Hollywood. Oh, and Wesley, you were, you were, sorry, I don't know how to say his name. Wesley is also on Instagram, so check him out too. <laughs> Little known fact, Chaka and the Pakuni were Swedish. They kept saying Ota. I'm not sure why they're saying the number eight, but Ota is Swedish for eight. And now everyone's favorite sea monster, Sigmund. Johnny and Scott are combing the rocks unaware that behind them Sigmund alert, prepared to give them a shot. Boo! In total surprise, the boys eye this blob, what can it be? And then it groans and moves and lo, it's a monster from the sea. Now Sigmund, the sea monster, and Johnny and Scott are friends. The finest friends that ever could be on the land or on the sea. Yes, that was Billy Barty as Sigmund. 
Sid and Marty Croft had so many terrific shows, though. I can't highlight them all here, but some others were Electra Woman and Dina Girl, Lidsville, Dr. Shrinker, Croft Super Show, and Far Out Space Nuts. <laughs> 